Hello everyone, this is me Sharon. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. And for today's video, ipapakita ko sa inyo kung paano gawin itong granny square bell ornament. Napakadali lang niyang gawin. Tapos, kailangan mo lang ng color green or red. Basta color ng Christmas. Tapos, yung sparkling yarn or yung kung meron ka metallic dyan or gold, mas mainam para maihalo sa yarn. So, I hope you watch until the end of this video. Subscribe na rin for more video tutorials. For the materials, ito nga pala yung ginamit yung yarn, yung nabili ko sa Japan Surplus na medyo gold and silver. Ito naman yung nabili ko sa Baguio na lightweight yarn. Tapos, ang hook na gagamitin is 3.75. Kailangan din ng yarn needles and then scissors. So, sa pag-start ng project, gagawa muna tayo ng magic ring. Tapos, yung chain 3 will count as 1 double crochet. After nating maglagay ng chain 3, work 1 double crochet, followed by chain 1. So, ulitin lang natin yan. 2 double crochets, then chain 1, 4, 4 more times. Para we have a total of 6 2 double crochets, then chain 1 around. So, sa pag-end ng round, lagi tayong mag slip stitch doon sa top ng chain 3 natin. Yun yung nagka-count as 1 double crochet. Now, we're gonna slip stitch into the next stitch until we get to chain 1 space. Once we slip stitch into the chain 1 space, doon tayo mag-start ng ating clusters of 2 double crochets, chain 1, and 2 double crochet. Do not forget itong chain 3 will always count as one double crochet into this project or into every round. So once done, we will just repeat into every chain one space, two double crochet, chain one, then two double crochet. Napakadali lang nitong project na to kasi itong round two na to, uulitin lang natin hanggang round six. So when you start this round two, you will be repeating this until you get to round 6. So, ganun lang siya kadali. Ngayon, pag natapos nyo na yung round, do not forget to always work a slip stitch on top of the third beginning chain o yung chain 3 na tinatawag natin. Always work your way until you get to the chain 1 space because that's where we're gonna start each round. So for round 3, we are just going to repeat what we did in the previous round.
Once matapos na natin ang round 6, for round 7 naman, slip stitch your way until you get to chain 1 as usual. And then we're gonna start with 1 double crochet, which is equal to chain 3. And then we're going to work 7 more double crochet all into the same chain 1 space. Into every chain 1 space, we will work 8 double crochets. For the edging naman, we're gonna work one single crochet in between the clusters of eight double crochets. So, ganun lang kadali yun. We will go under the two stitches there. And then, we'll work one single crochet into each of the eight clusters of double crochets. So, ulitin lang natin yan until we get back around.
Next naman is gagawin natin yung pinaka loop niya para maisabit natin sa ating Christmas tree. And ang gagamitin ko naman is yung sparkling yarn ulit tapos yung green one para may color yung ating palawet. So you can do the same thing using the sparkling yarn combined with the green one. Or say if you have a sparkling yarn na medyo makapal na hindi mo na kailangan doblin sa, sa any ordinary yarn na meron ka. So for me, I'm going to use this combination and then I will chain up until I get to the length that I want. Usually, I I think I did about 30 to 40 chains. Tapos, tatahiin ko siya dun sa pinaka top part ng ating bell para maitali ko siya at hindi siya basta-basta makakalas.